Dear ladies and gentlemen, a few words about the bacterial infection of respiratory tract uh, of wild boars. Uh, a few words about the previous lecture. Uh, we now know uh, the importance of the population and the spreading of the disease. Uh, therefore, the aim of our investigation was uh, to uh, see the importance of bacterial infection of respiratory tract of wild boars. Uh, the material for our investigation uh, was uh, sampled uh, on three hunting areas. We applied uh, uh, clinical pathological investigation uh, of um, animals uh, and also transgenic investigation of uh, aerobic and anaerobic uh, bacteria and uh, parasitolo parasitology investigation. In uh, two uh, hunting grounds which were investigated, uh, we found uh, problems uh, with respiratory tracts of young animals, uh, wild boars, uh, uh, with uh, intensive um, uh, breathing, uh, uh, problems uh, with lungs, and so on. Within the scope uh, of the investigation on the health status of animals, uh, we performed uh, um, harvesting and uh, we found the uh, different discharge uh, uh, within the lungs uh, uh, with clinical signs, health disorders, uh, which uh, the, the, the presence uh, of lung worms was found in trachea, bronchi, and in posteroventral parts of the diaphragmatic lung lobes. Uh, however, there were a few cases with uh, um, uh, different uh, changes and histologically we proved the presence uh, of the dead wild boars, the presence of uh, uh, different uh, uh, infection, in, infects, uh, or including other uh, parasites. Bacteriological investigation of lungs and uh, nodes uh, gave us uh, the presence of Streptococcus, Actinobacillus, uh, and the Sherichia coli. Uh, the individuals were investigated um, and the findings were confirmed uh, with the animals who were uh, low in the development of body mass. Um, these are the findings of uh, lungs. Uh, seen uh, on the cross sections and also uh, the presence of infectious agents in trachea. The third uh, hunting ground uh, also showed the problems of uh, uh, the young animals uh, which uh, moved very slowly. They were easy to catch uh, and the harvesting uh, was uh, performed. Uh, the uh, Bacterial examination showed the signs of serious diseases, and in some cases, fibrinose pneumonia was found. These are the processes as seen on the lungs with the sputum and the great number of infectious agents with the changes on the lungs. This is a great number of uh, lung uh, infections. This is the sum of our investigation with the number of uh, investigated animals, uh, pathological changes and findings. We could conclude that uh, it is very difficult to see uh, the um, control, to perform the control um, at the right uh, place at, in the right time. It is a very complex question that uh, uh, asks uh, for special strategy. In pathomorphological findings, we found uh, changes of subacute and acute uh, uh, processes. Processes uh, connected with the lung problems uh, were more than obvious, uh, uh, confirming the infection uh, with the signs of the disease. Thank you.